Hello, it's William from NF3D here. Today we'll be speaking about some of the issues we've had on the tornado, our Christmas competition, prints and calibrations we've done on the tornado, filament we've used, and we'll also be giving you our S3D profile that we used on the tornado. Let's begin. Now on to the issues in future projects we have planned for the tornado. Our major issue and the issue we seen a lot in the TiVo tornado community was the print surface. As you can see, our print surface is a new one. It's called Filiprint. A bit costly, but it is really good. The problems we had with the print surface was Prints were sticking really good, but they weren't releasing that good. And after a while, prints wouldn't stick to it at all. So we had to replace it with Filiprint. Filiprint is a really good surface. It lasts ages prints stick to it, when the prints cool down, they just come off. Future projects we have for the tornado is, we have noticed that some of our prints has had salmon skin, so we will be adding TL smoothers to the tornado. We will also be adding Jewel Z onto the tornado. Now on to our prints that we've printed on the tornado. First of all, there's this clown. There was an error with it, it's just because the print started working a bit and it came off the print surface, so it started printing in thin air. This isn't down to the tornado, it was just down to cold weather. We had it up in our attic. There's a butterfly trying to attack my fiance, another uh, another person that's part of Inner 3D. So if you see a butterfly flying around, it's trying to attack my fiance, Lynn. It's right there just now. <laughs> Attacking butterfly. Okay. Okay. One. Clown. We got this on Thingiverse. <coughs> The link to this will be down in the description, so anybody can download and print it. Okay, okay. Mickey Mouse. Okay, as you can see, <coughs> it's orange. That's because we sprayed um, filler primer onto it. Filler primer is to smooth out any of the layers. Even though on the tornado, with us using cheap genetic filament, we noticed that the tornado didn't have any as much layer lines as there some of their other printers aside. So, meaning it's pretty good quality, just up and running. We're having calibrate the tornado at all here. So here's our Mickey. What we'll be doing with the Mickey is sanding it down, putting more filler primer on it, getting it ready for painting. We'll be painting this for Mickey colours. Okay. We also have another printer we'll be reviewing soon. It's called the S East 3D Gecko. This is files that we got in the East 3D Facebook group for their spool holder. Great prints, hardly any layer lines. We do have to adjust slight stringing, but I think that's just because of uh, uh, filament heat. 
just need to lower it a tiny bit. Now, calibrations. This is our retraction, retraction and stringing calibrations right here. From our first one to our last. As you can see, we have set up our S3D pretty good for retraction and stringing. But if you download our S3D profile, you will have to still adjust the temperature, especially for white. White filament needs a slightly lower temperature. Okay, and this is our bridging calibration. First ever bridging we've done. Yes, we've got a lot more to test than this, but it's pretty good for our first test. Okay. Now on to our big print. This print took about 44 hours. It's a print that will be in our competition that people have to paint, show off the picture to win a prize. And the prize is one of these two filaments, one and two. And this big model of Harlequin. Links in description where to get the model from in the description. Okay. As you can see, again hardly enter any layer lines. There is salmon skin. Won't be able to see it with zooming in, but there is salmon skin. Now onto the filament we're using in the tornado. This one is cheap genetic 3D printer filament. And it printed pretty good on the tornado, even though it's cheap. Links will be in the description for this filament. We also used high quality filamentive filament. Sorry we haven't got much prints for this filament yet, but we will have in the future. This printed really good. There was, you could hardly see any of the layer lines. It went down smooth. The temperatures was great. The tolerance was great. Everything was great with, with the filament. The filament. I highly recommend this film. Now into the competition. This is the model you'll need to purchase to enter the competition. The price to purchase it is roughly one GPP, which is eighty cent roughly. All you need to do is purchase a model, print it any way you like, any filament, paint it, lost PLA casting, any kind of casting. You can remix it if you want. You'll get all the files to do whatever you want with the model. Only thing we ask you not to do is share the model. If you share it to someone, they try to enter the competition they won't be able to because we'll know who's purchased it. The links for this complete competition will be in the description. Now on to the prizes you could win. Our main prize that you could win is Harlequin. Link in description where you can purchase this model. Uh, it comes in two parts. For hammer and the main body. We might also give you the hair not together for shipping purposes, but all you'd need to do is super glue them together because we really don't want the hair to break off in shipping. What else? you could win is one 
of these two foods, you get to choose either or which one you'd like. You have not used this filament at all or any other of this filament we have. So we don't know the quality, how it prints, we don't know anything about the, print, the, uh, the filament. But this is just added extra that you could win. Everything you've seen for this video, all the links, links to the articles, they'll start on the 27th of November. We were going to make it last till the beginning of January, but because it's Christmas holidays and everything, we thought we'd extend it to the 1st of February. So you have from the 27th of November to the 1st of February to enter the competition and present your model. Thank you.